Hello again and welcome to the Ming Xian channel. Today I'm just going to give a quick tutorial about fishing. So fishing is kind of interactive in this game compared to many other games. It is kind of similar to the New World fishing but it is still slightly different. It's very unique. I actually really enjoy it. And I'm going to show you a really awesome spot that's great for leveling up your fishing. Um, and yeah, the there's like what is called hot spots in the game of fishing and so as you can see in front of me you see like a little glittering glowing pool with a fish jumping out that's what a hot spot looks like so i'm going to show you this spot i'm going to open my map this is in kilima on the main island so you'll see your housing plot here you'll simply just go to the right to where whispering banks is over here and right next to this little kilima sign right here is where i'm gonna be You'll find a little dock with a little cute fishing symbol. Uh, this is also a really great spot if you're wanting to hunt deer. There's usually deer like loaded in here and across the water above. But simply, this is the hot spot that I always fish at. It does not go away. I'm not really sure if they're ever going to nerf this or what. But this fishing spot does not go away. So, I am a little bit higher fishing so I do have worms available. I'm just going to simply show you how to do this. So if you click R once again, you click and you select your fishing pole. So I've got my fishing pole in my hand. So now I have a worm down in my inventory on slot 3. So to simply equip your worm, you just hit the button 3, you press your right mouse button, and you click the worm, and it's attached. And you do not have to attach it every single time you cast. The worms stay hooked on your pole until you're completely done you probably go back home and do some other stuff so fishing is a little bit more interactive in this game to cast your reel you're going to hold down your left arrow key the harder or the longer you press your left arrow key the further out it's going to toss so if i do that i'm going to miss the pool this pool is a little weird so it's going to show like a red line um, i'm just like tossing it out just to show you but if I go to like a normal fishing spot, it's going to show like a blue casting line and there's going to be a blue circle and it's going to kind of help you land your, your line every time in the hot spot or wherever you're fishing. For this one, I just kind of cast up to my shoulder lightly and it's always going to land in there. So this is a little bit different than other games. You're going to see the bobber move a couple times. Do not click it right away you're gonna want to wait. The fish is gonna go crazy. Now, a tip here is you always want to reel in. You never want to stop reeling. To reel in, you're gonna hold your left arrow key or your left mouse key down. At the same time, I'm gonna cast again to show you guys that you guys saw the two looking green parentheses. Your goal is to keep the fish in between those two because if you get perfect catches, you get more XP to level up your fishing. To simply keep the fish in between the arrow keys, you just move your mouse from left to right of whatever direction that the fish is going. So I'm moving it to the left, moving it to the right, and then once it gets closer to you, your person catches it. Um, you're not always guaranteed a level 1 quality fish, even with a worm, but it does help your chances of getting a 1 star quality fish. This is just a quick overview of fishing. Uh, you can use the fish for cooking, you can also just eat certain fish. Uh, most of them are used through um, cooking. You can also use fish, I believe, in your worm farms to decompose them to make um, fertilizer for your garden, as well as more worms for fishing in general. Uh, fishing can be a huge money maker. There are other spots that give you more rare fish. But in terms of just leveling your fishing quickly, I believe that this is the best spot because the hot spot literally never disappears. Um, if you want to use this spot, I would use it quickly um, just in case that they do decide to nerf it. Um, as like I said, this hot spot never disappears and it is a great opportunity to level your fishing very quickly. I hope you enjoy this video. If you guys have any comments or questions, please leave them down below. Please like and subscribe. and. I will see you on the next video. Thank you.